Whether you are a student, a researcher or a job seeker, presentations are opportunities for you to ace your project, getting a research grant or your dream job. But why presentation is given so much importance? Presentations are powerful ways to showcase your knowledge, passion and persuasiveness. A great presentation not only helps in communicating your ideas and work but also leaves a lasting impression on your audience. On the other hand, you all might have experienced a poor presentation can put people to sleep within a matter of seconds. And I know how stressful it is to stare at a blank screen wrestling with the content and how to make a visually appealing presentation. But what if I tell you AI could take your pain and work for you to make your presentation? You heard that right. Like many other tasks, AI can be used to assist you in presentation making too. Hello and welcome back to AI series of Explore Bio with Dr. Abhishek. I make series of videos on AI tools, research and publishing and others to make lives of students and researchers easier. I am sure these videos will help you in your research journey. In today's video, I will demonstrate in a step-by-step -step manner with example how you can create presentation content using AI and how to easily make a presentation using it. Artificial intelligence has become a true game changer across many fields, fundamentally altering how we live and work. And in today's world, it is important for us to put AI to work and make our lives easier. Let's see how. The first thing that bothers us about presentation is its content. You can spend hours just thinking about what to write on a particular topic. For instance, if you have to make a presentation on global warming, you need to collect relevant information from various sources. If you Google it, it will provide several links and it takes a lot of time to go through each of these links and extract useful information out of them. Similar is the case with the books and PDFs. No doubt they help you improve your knowledge, but at the same time they are time taking too. Here are three easy and free to use AI tools, ChatGPT, Gemini and Copilot to create suitable content for you within a matter of seconds. You just have to enter suitable prompt and AI will analyze your topic generate ideas, collect content for you, and even write drafts for your slides. First, I will tell you how to generate presentation content using ChatGPT. Suppose I want a presentation content on global warming. I ask ChatGPT to use its own knowledge to generate a response. I also want some possible solutions to overcome the problem of global warming. As soon as I hit the enter, you can see it is starting generating a response. You can see it is providing slide-wise content. But the major limitation with the free version of ChatGPT is that it does not provide real-time data and also it is not capable of generating images. It may even ask us to fill in some of the details by ourselves. Now let's see how you can generate presentation content using Microsoft's Bing Copilot. It uses ChatGPT4 to generate the content. Within a matter of seconds, the AI tool generates slide-wise content for making presentation slides. At the end, you will also find the resources it has referred for more details. The third AI tool and one of my personal favorite is Gemini AI. This tool not only generates presentation content in bullet points, but also speaker notes for practicing and also images relevant to the slides that you can directly copy to your presentation. If you find the image is not suitable or you want to use different image, then you can write a better prompt asking for a particular image for a particular slide. You can also ask Copilot to generate images for you. Compared to other tools, it may sometimes generate better images. So you may try at least once. To unleash the true power of AI, you need to play around with the prompt based on the audience, presentation style, etc. For instance, I am clearly mentioning the topic, target audience as a student's presentation style and other necessary details. And you can see it is generating a suitable content for your presentation. Only by giving the AI clear instructions, you will harness the true power of AI and get a presentation tailored to your needs. Once the AI generated content is ready, you can modify the content or add additional information by copying it in the Microsoft Word or other such document as per your need. Coming on to the step number two, which is making presentation using AI generated content. For making presentation, I will tell you two ways. The first one is the online tool Canva for creating PPTs. You can choose presentation and then choose suitable template as per your choice. 
or you can simply search it in the search bar. Just select a template to customize. You can remove or add images as you wish. You can copy the presentation content as I am doing here. Let's see after adding all the text and images how the presentation looks like. The second most popular tool that you can use to create presentation is Microsoft PowerPoint. I myself routinely use it for my presentation. I prefer to keep my presentation simple and elegant. If you wish, you can choose among the existing themes of Microsoft PowerPoint to make your presentation. So today we have learned how you can use AI tool like ChatGPT, Copilot and Gemini to generate presentation content and how you can make presentation using Canva and Microsoft PowerPoint. AI tools can simplify your work by providing you the content and generate suitable points for presentation. But for an outstanding presentation, it is always advisable to verify the content, review your slides, customize the layouts, and add your personal touch, and at last, practice it several times. If you ever used any AI tool for your presentation or other academic work, do mention it in the comment below. AI tools can also be used to prepare presentation from a research paper or your own research work. If interested, mention that in the comment too. Check out my other useful videos on AI tools, research and publishing and lot more. Thanks and see you in my upcoming video.